I'm keeping it quiet. Uh. I pull up, you know I be moving. Whipping the four and I'm cruising. The money I'm speaking to fluent. This is the second date update on the 10 with Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa. The Get Up Crew. Hot 969. Troy, how can we help you, sir? Uh, well, I hit up this girl named Becca on Tinder um, probably like a month ago. We've been on about four times, um, and now she's not paying attention to me at all. She's ignoring my text and uh, blocked me on Tinder straight up. So oh, Jesus. I don't know. I don't know if you guys can help get a hold of her and see what's going on for me. I mean, this should be easy. Last time you guys hung out, how'd you f*** up? Um, to be honest with you, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to – I don't know if I f- up, but like – we got into a little bit of an argument because she brought up her niece and I guess her sister just had a kid and she was saying that she wanted to have kids. And I mean, you know, we're young. So I, I kind of laughed when she said it and then she got a little defensive <laughs> and we went back and forth a little bit. But I mean, I'm not, I'm not really in the place where I want to have kids. So right. maybe yeah. I, I react a little harshly, but I don't know. Yeah. Laughing is probably not the best right. thing to do. I could see why she would block. <laughs> like, did you kind of like a pot? Like, how did after you guys got through that little tiff? Was it cool, or did you sense that she was still holding on to it? Um, I didn't think she was holding on to it, but she's a spicy lady, so um, maybe she was a little more mad than I thought. Yeah, I mean, I can see that's why uh, that being a reason as to why she would block you. But uh, we'll, we'll give her a call for you next, right? Hell yeah, good luck. Thanks. All right, here's the deal if you're just joining us. We talked to Troy. He and this girl, Becca, went out a couple times. Last time when they went out, she mentioned something about uh, her sister having a baby. He laughed because he doesn't want her to have any kids. <laughs> and I could see why that would set off an alarm in her to the point where apparently she blocked them. <laughs> well, okay. She hasn't responded, no blocks, anything. But we're going to try and get in contact with her and tell her that, you know, Troy just doesn't want to have kids now. That's the lie I'm going to tell her. Is that cool with you, Troy? That's a, that's a good lie, man. You came up with that on the spot? That's yeah, nice. man. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. You just play along and be like, yeah, yo, how many kids you want? Six, seven? I'll give them to you. You're right. Try not to laugh when you say <laughs> that, though. Um, all right. Stay quiet. We're going to call her right now. Hello? Hi. It, it, good morning. Is this Becca? Yeah. Be- Becca, hi. Uh, please don't hang up. Uh, this is Hot 96.9, the radio station calling you. And we're, I can explain to you really quickly. We got your number from a, a gentleman who would love to take you out on a date. If you say yes, I- I'll tell you who the gentleman is because you know him. Obviously, he has your phone number. Um, but we'll also pay for whatever date you you choose. So you can pick the place, the day, the time, whenever you're free. We'll rent out the restaurant and you and this this guy can see if you hit it off. And according to him, you guys have a chemistry already. Oh, really? You, you do. You ready for the guy's name? Yeah. Yeah, no surprises here. His name is Troy. And before you say anything, wait, 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 before you say anything. <laughs> no. No, no, listen, 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 I know what it She's is. not letting you get it yeah. out. No, no, we, we know what it is. We spoke to him. He said that he apologizes for laughing at the whole baby situation and that he is not opposed to having kids if he's with the right woman in the future. And he thinks you could be that right woman. So the he's sorry for the laughing. Oh, no, no. He is a he's he's creepy. I don't have no time. For that, <laughs> that's cute. So that's cute. <laughs> what did he? What did, what, what did he do? That's creepy. So yeah, we got on the topic of kids. Uh, I asked if he wanted, you know, if he wanted kids, and he goes into the story about how his last girlfriend and him broke up because he didn't want to have kids with her. And I was like, well, why? What was wrong with her? You know, or like, you want to have kids? Turns out he was dating his cousin. What? For four wait. Years. Yes. Wait, 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 Hold wait, wait, on. wait, 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 wait. Uh, we need details on he this. He was dating his cousin for years? For four years. And wait, broke up okay. because he didn't want to have kids with her. But what level say, of cousin? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah what, we when need, you say cousin, right. I mean, not the... <laughs> Pebbles has 30,000 cousins and they all live in Wareham. Yeah. <laughs> 
Numero uno cousin. You're First lying. Cousin. Hey, guys, yeah. hey, can, can, can I jump in here yeah, real quick? Please, yeah, really cool. please. Rebecca, Troy, Troy's on the phone and he heard all that. Oh, uh, God. Troy. No, I feel broken. Yeah, I, I just lost yeah. my appetite. Can you explain if all this is true? Okay, um, you, yes. I mean, it's true that I, I dated my first cousin for four years, but I mean, first off, my mom's sister is her half sister. She lives in California. Uh, it's not that big of a deal. Uh, it was weird at first. Bro, that, that's, that's still, that's that still, that's still oh, first dear. cousin. Ew. Oh, I, I don't know how to explain it more than that. It's really not a big deal. Hold on, hold on. Did you, was your family cool with this? Um... Not my mom's side of the family, so we hung out with her dad's side of the family for get-togethers and stuff like that, and yeah. they weren't really 100% aware of what was going on, so yeah. Right. I, bl- I blame Game of Thrones, Pebbles. It's because of all that. Uh, uh, Look, man, love doesn't have any boundaries. When you, when you really, truly love somebody, I disagree that's- with that, but okay. <laughs> that's, oh, I mean, Lord. okay. I was going to try and help you with the whole, like, having kids thing, but... I can't with this. Becca, would you like to go yeah. out yeah. again with the cousin? No, f- she doesn't. No. <laughs> no. Yeah? No. Is it because you're afraid you're related to him or? Oh, you f- one cousin and you're a yeah. cousin f- forever. Okay, yes. that's it, you know? Yes. Tomorrow on the second date update on the 10th. Right, uh, when you first meet your date's kid, just minimize the contact with them, okay? Don't don't try and go above and beyond to be friends with them. Otherwise, you're going to yeah. end up talking to us. Weezy, I- not in a good way either. Check out a brand new second date update on the 10th tomorrow.